Welcome to Trends Compilation. Across the globe, people are grappling with the growing COVID-19 pandemic that's increased every day and panic levels are high in various countries. Thankfully, fear hasn't stopped people from inspiring us all in these scary times. These famous celebrities and athletes would touch your heart for giving back to their communities during the coronavirus pandemic. Zion Williamson Zion Latif Williamson, an American professional basketball player for the New Orleans Pelicans of the National Basketball Association, announced on Instagram Instagram that hell helped cover the salaries of those who work at the Smoothie King Center. He quoted, My mother has always set an example for me about being respectful for others and being grateful for what we have. And so today, I am pledging to cover the salaries for all of those Smoothie King Center workers for the next 30 days. This is a small way for me to express my support and appreciation for these wonderful people who have been so great to me and my inmates. And hopefully, we can all join together to relieve some of the stress and hardship caused by this national health crisis. This is an incredibly resilient city full of some of the most resilient people. But sometimes, providing a little extra assistance can make things a little easier for the community. Kevin Love Kevin Wesley Love, an American professional basketball player for Cleveland Cavaliers of the National Basketball Association, was one of the first athletes who stepped in to help the stadium stop that will struggle over canceled games. He promised $100,000 US dollars to benefit workers at Cleveland's Rocket Mart Gage Fieldhouse. He quoted on Instagram, Be kind to one another. Be understanding of their fears, regardless if you don't feel the same. Be safe and make informed decisions during this time. And I encourage everyone to take care of themselves and to reach out to others in need whether that means supporting your local charities that are canceling events or checking in on your colleagues and family Donatella Francesca Versace and Allegra Versace Beck Donatella Francesca Versace an Italian fashion designer and businesswoman along with her daughter Allegra Versace Beck gave 200,000 euros to Milan San Rafael Hospital to address supply shortages and limited supplies in time like this it is important to be united and support However, we can to help all those who are in the front line fighting every day to save hundreds of lives, Versace said in a statement. Our hearts go out to all those who have been affected by this disease and to all the doctors and medical staff who have been working heroically non-stop in the past weeks in the effort to take care of our loved ones. Shira Firagni Shira Firagni, an Italian entrepreneur, fashion blogger, influencer and designer, along with her husband, made a personal donation of 100,000 euros to a GoFundMe campaign. They started to help hospitals in Italy which have been overwhelmed by the number of patients infected with COVID-19. The money they put forth was specifically to help provide new hospital beds in Milan San Rafael Hospital Intensive Care Unit where there have been shortages. We hope that this initiative will raise awareness among people in Italy and abroad of the current coronavirus crisis which is affecting all of us, the couple said in a statement. J.J. Watt and Kelia Ohaye Kelia Ohaye Watt, an American soccer player who plays for the Chicago Red Stars of the National Women's Soccer League since 2020. Along with her husband, J.J. Watt, an American football defensive and for the Houston Texans of the National Football League, donate $350,000 US dollars to the Houston Food Bank to aid in relief efforts during the pandemic. Blake Lively and Ryan Reynolds Ryan Rudy Reynolds, a Canadian-American actor, comedian, film producer, and screenwriter, along with his wife Blake Lively, announced via Instagram that they would be donating one million to be split between the two charities which are helping to feed people, especially elderly adults and low-income families during the pandemic. Lively encouraged others to donate if they can and to stay connected with friends and family via FaceTime, Skype, and video. We can all do something for one another even if the staying hope she wrote of course she also got in a job at her husband writing now can someone just tell ryan that emotional distancing from his mother-in-law is not a thing nothing can save him ariana grande ariana grande is an american singer songwriter and actress recently spoke about the importance of social distancing i keep hearing from a surprising amount of people's statements like this isn't a big deal we'll be fine we still have to go about our lives and it's really blowing my mind she wrote in an Instagram story, I understand if that is how you felt weeks ago. But please read about what's going on. Please don't turn a blind eye. 
It is incredibly dangerous and selfish to take the situation that lightly she continued. That we will be fine because we're young mindset is putting people who aren't young and or healthy in a lot of danger. You sound stupid and privileged and you need to care more about others like now. Grande is using her platform to encourage her fans to do more than just stay indoors. My heart hurts for the small businesses, individuals, and families affected by all of this. She said an Instagram story on March 19, listing a group of organizations she is currently supporting, including the Opportunity Fund, Give Directly, Feeding America, Cruz Rosa Italiana, and the World Health Organization. Netflix has created a 1 million US dollars relief fund for workers in the creative community as almost all television and television film production has now ceased globally due to the coronavirus pandemic as hundreds of thousands of crew and cast has been left without jobs including electricians, carpenters, drivers, hair and makeup artists and more. Netflix has created the fund to help support the hardest hit workers on its own productions around the world. This community has supported Netflix through the good times and we want to help them through these hard times, said Ted Sarandis. Netflix chief creative officer said in a statement, especially while governments are still figuring out what economic support they will provide, so we've created a 100 million US dollars fund to help with hardship in the creative community. Angelina Jolie Angelina Jolie, an American actress, filmmaker, and humanitarian, donated $1 million to No Kid Hungry, an organization helping to feed children who relied on school lunches for their meals. As of this week, over a billion children are out of school worldwide because of closures linked to coronavirus, she said in a statement. Many children depend on the care and nutrition they receive during school hours. Being nearly 22 million children in America who rely on food support. No Kid Hungry is making resolute efforts to reach as many of those children as possible. Rihanna's Clara Lionel Foundation the Clara Lionel Foundation, the non-profit organization founded by Rihanna, announced this weekend that it is donating $5 million to COVID-19 efforts across the globe. It said it will be supporting underground partners working on the front lines of disaster response, especially those focused on protecting and serving marginalized communities. It cited groups doing so such as Direct Relief, Feeding America, Partners in Health, the World Health Organization's COVID-19 Solidarity Response Fund, and the International Rescue Committee. Among other initiatives, the foundation's funds will go towards supporting local food banks for at-risk communities in the U.S., accelerating testing and care in countries such as Haiti and Malawi, mobilizing resources and support for native communities, training healthcare workers, and providing equipment for frontline health workers, many of whom are currently grappling with a shortage of masks, breathing equipment, and more. It also plans to help establish and maintain intensive care unit and accelerate the development of vaccines and other therapies. Never has it been more important or urgent to protect and prepare marginalized and undeserved communities, those who will be hit hardest by this pandemic, said Justin Lucas, the executive director of the Clara Linnell Foundation in a release. From acts of kindness to major donations that will help those who are sick and or out of work, there are just a few of the ways celebrities and regular people alike are doing good in the media a coronavirus outbreak. For more videos, please like and subscribe and don't forget to ring the bell. Thank you!